Everyday Health is brought to you by the Freighter and the Medical College of Wisconsin Health Network. Let's push ahead to keep life moving forward. It's estimated 1 million people in the United States have Parkinson's disease, with about 90,000 people diagnosed each year. Parkinson's is a chronic and progressive disease, meaning symptoms become worse over time. Here to tell us more is Dr. Kanal Gupta, a neurosurgeon with the Freighter and the Medical College of Wisconsin Health Network. Doctor, thank you so much for being here today. Thank you very much for having me. What is Parkinson's disease? Parkinson's disease is one of the most common neurodegenerative disorders in the United States. The number of patients with Parkinson's disease continues to increase over time. It's caused by the loss of dopamine-producing neurons in the brain, and these cells um, are, are responsible for a number of different functions. These include movement, motivation, and mood. What are some of the signs and symptoms? There are a number of different signs and symptoms in Parkinson's disease, and these can vary from patient to patient. The main symptom people experience are movement-related, so this includes tremor, slowness, stiffness, difficulty initiating movement and walking. There are a number of other symptoms as well that include memory dysfunction, cognition, sleep disruption, as well as changes in digestion, including speech and swallowing, constipation, and difficulty with food transit through the stomach. Tell us about the different treatment options your team offers. There are a number of treatment options available. An important one we could all be doing a lot more of is exercise. It can help improve movement, strength, and balance in patients with Parkinson's disease. When you meet a neurologist, an important one is medication related, and this can help restore dopamine balance in the brain. Certain patients are candidates for surgical therapies with a neurosurgeon such as myself. This includes deep brain stimulation. We also have some exciting new therapies coming down the pipeline, which include advanced technologies, as well as clinical trials, including cell-based therapies. Doctor, thank you so much for being here today. Find a doctor who's right for you by visiting freighter.com movement.